six days of war turned into 46 years of occupation. For Palestinians, this has meant 46 years of living without the protection of laws, without respect for their human rights, and with stifling restrictions on all aspects of their lives, restrictions inconsistent with human dignity and with the Palestinian right of self-determination, which has been deferred and denied for far too long. Abusive nighttime arrest procedures, arbitrary detention, torture, and other forms of ill, uh, ill, inhumane, and humiliating treatment, coerced confessions, solitary confinement, denial of family visits, denial of access to legal representation, unacceptable conditions in prisons, lack of access to adequate health care, and denial of access to education unlawful transfer of Palestinians to prisons located within Israel. These issues have per persisted without significant correction through 46 years of occupation. It is critical to be mindful of the fact that Israel's occupation of Palestine is not static, that it continuously intrudes upon Palestinian rights it also systematically facilitates Israel's annexationist policies. Demolitions, displacements, settlements, resource ap appropriations, detention and imprisonment, and large-scale and excessive violence are some of the tools that Israel relies upon to pursue such policies. It seems to us that such policies and tools are not advancing peace in the Middle East and should be repudiated. 